Hey, what's up, Culinary 2? So if you're watching this video, it should be Culinary 2, which is my 3A or my 7B. So if you're not in either one of those classes, you're watching the wrong video. So you might want to click out of that and find the right one. But for those of you that are watching the right video, this is Culinary 2. And, you know, I uh, just want to say that, number one, I miss you guys, uh, you know, working in the restaurant and all like that. You, know, you kind of miss the people that you work uh, those long hours with and things like that. But, uh, you know, we're going to get through this. It's going to be a great time. Uh, I didn't want you to go so many weeks without seeing this face. So uh, as we go through this, I uh, just want to kind of walk you through a couple things. I'm going to make things kind of nice and easy to get started off with. One decision I've made is um, most of what I'm going to do is going to be based on these videos. I feel like sometimes I can explain it better through a video rather than having to give it to you all on a sheet of paper and you're just reading a bunch of mind-numbing stuff. And hopefully, to some degree, this will be a little entertaining and stuff like that. You know, if I decide to do a prep video, whatever the case may be. This gets it going, okay? So, um, as many of y'all remember, uh, we're going to be uh, kicking off the fourth time weeks with the American Regional classes, okay? So, I still plan to do that. Now, here's the deal about the third nine weeks. I reviewed your um, last test, which was meat fabrication and cooking methods. Those grades were not great. So, if you look and focus, I did not put them there, all right? I chose that because I'm going to look at your overall grade and we're going to stick with that, okay? Um, I'm going to get to that in just a second. Going back to the test, what I've opted to do is one of your assignments, whether it be this week or next, I'm going to scan this upload it and then you're going to have another shot to do it with your notes or whatever the case may be okay whether you look online whatever it is this is going to be a chance for you to recover your grade because like i said the test was not that great remember guys study study it doesn't get easier after you leave chef habit okay it only gets tougher from here okay so we need to get on it just remember that please be working on that diligently and making sure you're ready okay so a couple things i want to discuss about the third nine weeks first all makeup work is due by this Friday, the 27th, okay? All makeup work. Several of you, even though I didn't add that the test grade in, your grade is not that good because you have missed a lot. You need to get the makeup work to me. Hopefully during spring break, you were working on it, okay? Here's the deal. I need you to upload that and send it to me as soon as you can. Now, if your family's having some sort of issues and you can't cook, whatever the case may be, whatever like that, please contact me. Remember, as I often say in class, I don't know if you don't tell me. So therefore, if you just don't do it, my assumption is you chose not to do it. All right. You need to get on it. But if you're having issues, please email me. I'll either give you another assignment. I will give you something to do that will cover two of them, whatever the case may be. If you're happy with your grade, you have nothing to worry about. That is going to be your third nine weeks grade. All right. So you don't have to worry about anything. You're pretty much going to be in that one spot. OK, um, there's not really a way to improve it or anything like that. If you're happy with your grade, you're just going to be stuck with it. OK, that's just kind of the way way it is right now. If I thought your test grade would have benefited your grade, I would have put that in. But for most of you, it wouldn't have done anything much for your grade because we had so many, so many grades in the grade book to begin with, okay? So I'm just going to hold on to that, all right? So make up work due this Friday by the end of the school day, please, okay? So that way I can bring the third nine weeks to an end. Now, your first grade on the fourth nine weeks is going to be KFC. Yes, I have not forgotten about it. Yes, you still have to do it, okay? So if you're watching this and it's Monday, your A day, it's going to be due tomorrow the 24th. Tomorrow the 24th, it's due. If you're my B day and you're watching this on the 24th, it's due on the 25th. Basically, I'm giving you a whole day and then that next day to get it turned into me. So you need to get on it and stuff like that. Now, here's the good news. If you took your notes home and you took your stuff home and you have your KFC, guess what? All you need to do is scan it, upload it. There's your assignment. Ain't that awesome? But for those of us that didn't bring our notebooks home, that didn't work on it, I've uploaded a, a Word document that has all of your KFC words and you're going to do your KFC words, okay? So all you got to do is Google whatever the case may be. Get on it, okay? Now, 
the test that I gave you that I said many of y'all did not do well on, what I've opted to do is on probably Wednesday and Thursday, I'm going to upload it and you're going to have to use your research, use technology, whatever the case may be, and you're going to go through that and get everything correct. I should see a hundred across the board when you download that assignment and work on it. Why? Because you have the internet at your disposal and everything was there. If you have your sheet that I gave you, literally everything is on that one sheet that I gave you. So if you brought your notebooks home, you're in a good shape. If you didn't, yeah. But don't worry, we're going to get through this, okay? Also, last thing I want to mention, if you have questions, comments, or concerns, get in touch with me. You can either do it through the team chat during our 20 minutes of uh, time together. We have A day 20 minutes, B day 20 minutes, whatever the case may be. Log in, chat with me, ask questions, whatever like that. If you don't want to do it where people can see it, shoot me an email. I will respond as quick as I can, okay? I will be logged in Monday through Friday all the way as a normal school day. Now, if you email me in the evening or you send me a chat in the middle in, in the evening of, through our team, I won't guarantee that I'm going to answer it immediately. I will do my best to answer it as quick as I can, but understand that once I go home for the evening, I will be with my family. I'll be chilling out much like the other teachers here at the school, okay? So just like normal, nothing is changing other than the fact that you won't be sitting here dialoguing with me, okay? I know. I'm going to miss you too. Dry tear. There you go. All right, uh, just make sure you stay on it, guys, okay? If I can encourage y'all in anything, take this time, keep up with everything you gotta do, okay? Don't fall behind. Some of you in this class, you're gonna be graduating, stay up with your stuff, don't let it go. For the rest of you, you need to stay up with your stuff so that way next year, you're gonna be ready to go with Culinary 3 and then moving on to Culinary 4. Don't get lazy, don't let this time where you're gonna go, oh, I can relax and stuff like that, and then you don't start doing anything. Stay on top of it. Don't get lost in all this stuff that's going on, okay? Stay on top of your work. Again, questions, comments, or concerns, email me, send a chat, whatever the case may be. Get in touch with me so that way I can help you, okay? Enjoy these videos. Hopefully, you'll be learning something out of them. I'll be trying to do my best for mixing them up just so they won't be boring. Today is kind of cut and dry because I wanted to make sure I get a lot of points across. So just make sure you get on, okay? Good job. We'll see you next time.